Hello traders, this is Nicolas from ProLCode.com. I'd like to show you today how to build a simple and yet effective stock screener for uh, ProLCode time. So uh, let's go. So uh, in this example, we'd like to find stocks that are already in a bullish trend, uh, a bullish trend defined by three moving average of different periods, uh, a 21, a 51 and a 201. Um, we are already on the chart, so we can begin the code to with defining the the variables of uh, this this true this free moving average. So uh, we had the average twenty period, average twenty, average fifty, and average two hundred period. Nice. So now we'd like to find if the average 20 period were already in a uptrend. So uh, it was above the 51 for um, some periods ago in the past. So let's make a condition one that re will we return true uh, 40 times. Uh, 40 times, so 40, 40 days, uh, if the average 20 were above the moving average 50 period. So uh, if the condition, uh, this condition return true, it will return uh, one value. So uh, we make the summation of uh, this one value uh, 40 times. So if it's true 40 times, it will return, uh, the world condition will return uh, 40. So we got it. Now uh, we'd like to, to, to make the same condition on 40 period also for the moving average 50 that were also above the moving average 200 periods uh, for 40 periods, 40, 40 days. Okay, so uh, we could screen this condition, but we're gonna make a, a wall condition that uh, have the, the all minus one condition and screen it. Okay, let's go, let's see what happened. So we got many stocks, but uh, they are also erratic, some not so good results. So maybe we could uh, filter a, a bit more. So we could make um, a condition to, to test if uh, there is a rebound of the current candlestick uh, on the moving average 20 periods. So how uh, do we test it? So firstly we gonna test a uh, cross of the low of the candlestick if it were um, if it was uh, below the moving average 20 periods and its close was above the moving average 20 pairs. So that's another condition. Another condition, different results. Okay, so we got a rebound on the moving average 20 periods. That's okay for that. But we'd like to have only bullish candlestick. So we test if the close uh, is above uh, the open little condition over over results okay so we got only blue candlestick that's great but um, what we'd like to see is um, a rebound made by uh, price reject so uh, we'd like to test if the um, the Present candlestick was almost like a pin bar or 
uh, yes, a pin bar. So what we can test if it's um, the wick of the of the candlestick is uh, bigger than the body of the candlestick. So what we can make is a comparison of the um, of the difference of the body with the uh, with the wick of the candlestick, which would be here the open minus the low, and um, this should be uh, the body should be. Uh, below uh, 50 percent okay so this condition would make make the trick so let's test it we got some result yeah so that's it we got uh, less body than the week and the condition is clear we got a rebound over in the uh, 20 period moving average in a bullish trend so that's a simple stock screener but that can be uh, improved by many more conditions of course so uh, that's it for this example so <laughs> that's okay see you in the next video bye bye